punch a hole in the dam. So, Israel, came up to Balperazim, and David smote the Philistines, there. Then David said, God has broken my enemies by my hand, like the bursting forth of waters, therefore they called the name of that place Balperazim, Lord of Breaking Through. 1 Chronicles 14 verse 11, the Amplified Bible. Like the bursting forth of waters. I love that phrase. It paints such a powerful and accurate picture of a breakthrough. Do you remember the story of the little boy who saw a leak in the dam and plugged up the hole with his finger? He knew that the force of the water flowing through that one tiny hole would have enlarged the leak with every second that passed. And, as the dam gave way to the pressure, that tiny trickle would have quickly become a raging flood. Reach out your hand in faith, expect God to break in upon your enemies just like he did for David. That's how your breakthrough will come like the bursting forth of waters. All you have to do is punch one little hole in that wall of problems, in that devilish dam that's been holding you back. Dig one tiny hole in it with your faith and with the word of God. Then keep tearing away at that hole by speaking out that faith day after day. Don't quit. Because God's forces are backed up behind you like an ocean of spiritual water. Each time you speak a word of faith, they leak through. The more you speak and the more you pray, the bigger that leak will get. Begin your breakthrough right now. Say, Lord Jesus, I rejoice today that you are Lord of my breakthrough. I thank you that the flood of your power is about to sweep through my life. I know there is no problem that can stand against it. Poverty can't stand against it. Family problems can't stand against it. Nothing the devil can do can stop my victory. I praise you for it now. Amen. Keep praying that. Keep believing that. And before long, the forces of God will come bursting through, demolishing every obstacle in their path.